So, this is me and my homeboy smooch sitting in front of the computer. The boys are carving pumpkins. I had another awful period of um, myoclonic. Now I have a vocabulary word for it. Jerks and seizure activity. And so then got um, along with them recommending <laughs> uh, that you upgrade your magnesium and your calcium and your electrolytes. They very definitely want you to upgrade your Neurontin. My doctor says this is Babesia Rage and Babesia Herx and it's full almost to its full capacity like it's just attacking me hardcore so um, I'm really sedated <laughs> that's why I'm sort of like Cheech and Chong <laughs> they're putting me on what's the new drug what? what's the new drug lorazepam a couple times a day and then they increased my neurontin. So more magnesium, more electrolytes, more calcium, increased neurontin, which makes you a little loopy anyway, and then this lorazepam, which based on what I'm finding is like Xanax. It does calm my body down. It doesn't remove that impulse like the electrical impulse to jerk I'm still feeling it in my body but my body's not responding so it's not really addressing the problem just the symptom but I guess that's better than nothing right and I'm a little bit bummed because you know, it's Halloween weekend and Halloween's like my favorite favorite holiday so I was gonna go to a party tomorrow and hopefully maybe I will maybe I won't be all googly like this. Um, oh, also to all you other limeys who follow protocol, they took away my clindamycin, which I take five times daily, just for now, because apparently my herxing is dangerous to the point where I don't need more help. So what remains in my protocol are, of course, my heparin trochees and my diflucan and my Neurontin, Zithromax, and then any kind of herbal, and, the, and then this new Lorazepam. But like every other pharmaceutical that I take is gone for now. Mepron, Plaquenil, gone. They just think I've reached a toxic place where I guess they have to sedate me. <laughs> You have reached a place in your health where you can no longer do it. You must be sedated so that you can laugh through it. Ha ha ha, I rhymed. I want to show you my friend Smooch. He's kicking it with me on the chair in front of the video camera. Can you see him? My friend Smooch. Kicking it with me. He's on my knee in front of the video camera. He's very handsome. He's got his chin on the desk. Oh, 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 there's me. Oh, there's Smooch. Oh. There is the pumpkin that my honey carved. This room is a hot mess, but there it is. I'm gonna see if I can zoom. Zoom. And now his son, my soon-to-be stepson, is making a very intricate pumpkin as we speak. But that is the first pumpkin of the year. I wouldn't try, dare try to pumpkin right now. <laughs> that would be bloody, which is sort of what the season is about, but I don't need to lose any more health points. I need to save all of my magic health points to go to the emergency room for me.
I'm just over there, that's a daisy because she's pretty. The dogs are clearly out of doors. The first pumpkin in the house. Except for my pumpkin, of course. My my pumpkin painting that's been up for a while, but that's the first real pumpkin. And he's beautiful. Very well done. Very well done. So, that was a really weird... That was a really weird McPeeper Spies on Drugs memo. I hope this totally doesn't mess up everything in my week. I hope it's just that the first couple of days it'll take a while to adjust to the drugs. I'm still in some pain, but the Darva set mixed with the whatever it's called, mixed with whatever it's called. <laughs> Are helping. I'm virtually cr crossed. My eyes are just virtually crossed behind this glasses. But since I started taking it, and I've taken two doses, I've had very little seizure or myoclonic jerking activity for about 10 minutes after I took the first one because I was already myoclonically jerking. But um, and since then there's been nothing, so they can't help you. I don't know if it's helped to really make you like one of the Doobie Brothers. Hey. I don't know much about the Doobie Brothers. They may have been total squares. They may be more like Frank Zappa. Everything is melting. Or widespread panic people. Or Grateful Dead people. Ooh, the room is melting. It hurts still. How's that possible? How is it possible to have a lot of major bone pain in your neck, hands, and knees, and feet, and be on so many drugs that make you like this? Like right here? Oh, hey, I wanted to go to a Halloween party tomorrow, and I needed to get finished with costumes. I need to memorize lines this weekend, but fucking listen to me. How is that gonna happen? I always get there in my own way. So I just need to not worry about it right now. Seriously, we. <laughs> This is so boring.